Um, I am, um, well, I came to the US uh, 31 years ago as a student. And since then I have became a, uh, uh, of course, a US citizen, an engineer and a manager of the city government. You know, in the past, when uh, my friends and relatives outside of U.S. ask me if this uh, uh, race system uh, exists um, in U.S., especially in San Francisco, I tend to uh, reply back, "What do you mean, I, I uh, racism? Uh, I I am we as the Chinese American, the Asian American, are the mainstream in in San Francisco, but uh, unfortunately, in the past." Uh, uh, the recent violent attack um, on us Asian American uh, really shatters my 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 belief. Um, that makes me realize that racism is only skin deep from us, and uh, is always ready to uh, spring up to our face at any time especially during difficult times like this. When tragedy happens, our leaders often tell us, we are better than this. But the sad truth is that America is, in terms of race, racism, in terms of race relationship um, against Asian American has never been better than that. 150 years after our ancestor built the Trans-Pacific Railroad and 80 years after the Chinese Exclusion Act was repelled, too many are still regarding us as foreigners. And if we don't fight back, America will never be better than this. I know some of our community members have pretty much repudiated political correctness because some of us think and believe political correctness benefit only others in the expenses of ours. But how do we foster a, the right political correctness that could uh, protect and benefit us, enable us to pursue, continue to pursue happiness in this country we call home, free of fear, free of hate, and free of being attacked? I believe that takes, you know, it not only takes a village, but it really takes a across the board effort. Across the board, uh, we have to unite it, unite with our uh, other, uh, si I mean, our sisters and brothers with other minority uh, group and community. I really hope the recent wave of violent attack against us uh, can serve as a wake up call. Because believe it or not, it could get worse. Just trying to imagine if the Sino-American relationship continued to hack south. Um, what if US and China is engaged in a war, a hard war, which is, could be a possibility. It, it is not, uh, it's not impossible. So I hope this, the recent event, tragic events could uh, really, really uh, prepare us uh, for even worse and, 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 and hope for the best. Thank you.